I think if you follow the Kardashians or you follow pop culture, then you know that these two have been butting heads for a little bit now for, for what seems like Over, a couple of years. It seems like a year plus at this point. And, you know, Courtney was really upset with Kim and it seemed like Kim didn't like that the attention was not on her during during Courtney's wedding. This is what Courtney got from it. Yeah. Um, you know, the Dolce & Gabbana thing. Courtney saying that Kim stole her whole thing and Kim then became an ambassador for Dolce & Gabbana after Courtney's wedding. And then Kim said that uh, Courtney stole her entire Dolce Vita lifestyle and her favorite singer and going to Italy and this whole thing. So just butting heads. And then they have this phone call where Kim tells Courtney that they have a side group chat called Not Courtney where they discuss things about Courtney, um, that has to fucking hurt. So she said, yeah, she, she said, sh- all your friends and are in it. it's also just like the way Kim delivered, like it's also the way Kim said it. Yeah. You know, because Kim, she wasn't yelling. It like wasn't anger. It just came from like diabolical, like a place of like, I just want to hurt you and I'm going to say it in a nice way. Yeah. And, she let Courtney know that her friends are a part of it and they all just dis- her, her kids her kids go she to said, her she said your kids have talked to me about how you are before it's like and and like I said it's the delivery it's the way she said it like it wasn't like they were yelling and screaming it was just like a just a slow like the dagger is here on her skin and Kim's just slowly pushing it like it's not a stab 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 yeah. stab stab it's just like a slow I will push. say to hear that information, Courtney handled it really well over the phone because being told that all your friends, all your yeah. family are talking about you in a side group chat named not Courtney because they want to be careful and have make sure that you're not in it and they're and they're saying, you know, they're concerned about you, whether you're happy. And she said she's happy when she's not with them. She was like, I don't fucking need you guys. I'm happy when I'm not with you guys. She said, I was happy five minutes ago before this phone call, which I do believe. I feel like Courtney genuinely is happy with Travis and happy with the life she's built with him and the Kardashian Jenner side of things that that does not fulfill Courtney. Yeah. And it fulfills Kim and they are just two opposite people that don't have the same goals or Mm -hmm. same things that they want in life. And they really disagree, but for for that's hurtful to hear. Yeah, yeah. To yeah. hear that from your own sibling is so no, Kim extremely her. hurtful. Um, and I think that Courtney handled it over the phone. Like, I don't know how else do you take that information in. Yeah. And Courtney's like, you guys need to get a fucking life. Yeah. Like she was like, I don't have. <laughs> she's like, I don't have side chats about people. And Kim's like, we have side chats about everybody. <laughs> Yeah. which was just like it was funny you know what i mean yeah, like yeah. watching it you're like laughing but but then thinking about courtney you're like damn that's gotta fucking hurt like th- there is n- there's nothing more hurtful than when your family member says something to you like that yeah. like that is just so mean yeah i, I totally agree i mean i can kind of see both sides a little it sucks recording for sure but i also feel like if you're in Kim's position and Courtney has just continually like sh- ba- not bash because she just does it in like a chill way, mm-hmm. but just like puts you down for your lifestyle and your choices. Mm-hmm. Like everything Kim does, like I feel like Courtney's like, well, I wouldn't do it. I wouldn't do that. Like I yeah. wouldn't do that. And it just feels like Courtney looks down upon the rest of her family. It's just yeah. like you greedy monsters and mm-hmm. I'm over here and I'm like, I live my life perfectly and I'm happy. Like it just feels like, hey, Courtney, get off your high horse Right, sometimes. because also you, know? you wouldn't have all those things unless you participated yeah. in all the like, things that so they So now it's just in. like, I can find it frustrating for Kim that you know Courtney now feels to be like above all of this Mm -hmm. right and it's your family like you don't want anybody to think that you're above your family you want to be included in family and at the end of the day like maybe Kim really doesn't realize like Courtney clearly felt that Kim had an attitude during her wedding like was not a fun to be around I guess there and Kim's like I don't 
think I was that way. Mm-hmm. And you're never gonna you're never gonna agree on that. Yeah, like neither of them are gonna st- change their point of views on that. It's just like having to move past that point and be like, okay, we gotta go past. But they keep referring back to the wedding, or it's right. like you, the way you handle that. Like I can't even believe somebody would act that way. I'm just thinking like. Is there there must be something that we haven't seen, right? Because from what we've seen, we just see the outer, you know, Kim congratulating her and the whole yeah. thing. And then there's did she say something to Courtney that right? Really we didn't made see Courtney any, like feel this way. Yeah, we didn't see any of it where it looked like Kim was but, miserable at the wedding. Yeah, I think you're right. Where you can this is such a this is a sibling fight. Like yeah. you can see both sides of it. Um, you're a witch because and I I'm, hate you. Yeah, I'm usually a, I'm usually on Kim's side with just yeah. because. I think Kim is hilarious, and I'm usually on a on the on Kim's side here. But um, no, this I was think a this was really ruthless, ruthless, ruthless Kim, and I sure. think it was really mean. And to find out that your family, like, why then would you? That's not going to make Courtney want to hang out with you guys more. Yeah. Finding out that you guys have a group chat, and then saying that they have it about everybody, and then you're like, this is exactly what I'm saying. Like, this does not make me feel happy that you guys yeah. are all talking about me like this. Um. So yeah, I just it was it yeah, was ruthless. Cor- Corny hit her with "You're a witch." Yeah, and I fucking hate you. Yeah, did she say "fucking hate you" or I, "and I hate you"? She said, "I hate you." And I hate you. Um, um, which is tough. So like, I I do think though that there's a lot of sisters that can relate to a fight like this where you're being so fucking mean, but you're mm-hmm. just kind of like talking normally, mm-hmm. and then you just like. It just kind of ends and you don't like you're they're not talking. But in the interview, in the first episode, they're sitting together and they're talking about this fight. So Mm -hmm. it's like they're still sisters. They still see each other. They're still talking about like right now. It's just everything is so every feeling just feels very heightened between the two of them. Like anything that right now they're in a phase that anything the other one does, it bothers. It bothers them. I just, I'm so stuck on the side chat thing. Like, damn. Like, you're going to say that to her over the phone? No, to be honest, I think the kids thing is even worse. I think being like... Oh, yeah, bringing the kids into it. I think being like, your kids, like, talk about how you are. Even your kids come to me. Like, oh, whoa, you didn't have to say that. Yeah, yeah. You know? No, that's what I'm saying. It was... It was ruthless, 100%. Um, And it also sucks because then the girls, like, all took a trip to Cabo... Um, Kylie, Kendall, Chloe, Kim, Chris, mm. Corey, <laughs> yeah, and uh, and Courtney didn't go because they were like clearly still fighting, and she didn't want it. She's just like over it; doesn't want to be with hanging out with any of them. 